David, I know you like Josh Berry here. What an opportunity it is for this guy to prove himself on the biggest stage. Well, I mean, I, I just think it's it's wonderful. An unfortunate situation, you know, the, uh, you know, grabbing a Josh Berry out of the Xfinity Series, I think that's perfect, you know. And Josh Berry's story uh, is just amazing. You know, it lets all the all the men, the boys and girls, or you know, the people out there racing these short track, dirt tracks, asphalt tracks around the country uh, in the NASCAR weekly racing series, you know, that this can happen to you. This, this is a possibility. If you work hard enough, dream big enough, be very passionate, you look at Josh Berry and you say, this can happen to me. So, you know, I, I love that Josh Berry drives for uh, Dale Earnhardt, Inc. I love it that he's a champion. He wins. He's great. He's a great talent. And, I, and, I, and I'm ex excited that it was Josh Berry uh, that Hendricks gave the phone call to to put in a, in a replacement of Chase Elliott while Chase is inj injured. Uh, I, just, I just think it's a great Cinderella story for many, many reasons. And one of the biggest reasons, it, it just lets – people know you know a lot of these you hear you know i go to a lot of race tracks uh when i get done racing on the weekends at a nascar race somewhere I'll, I'll find a dirt track or a little asphalt track and you know you see these young kids boys and girls that are very talented and and they and you you go you introduce yourself you talk to them say man i i don't know if i'll ever get the opportunity because i don't have money you know and uh you know, I always just tell them, hey, man, anything's possible if you work hard enough, if you dream big enough, and you don't ever give up on that dream. It's possible. And Josh Berry lets everybody know around the country that it is possible. And I think it's awesome to see him driving Chase Elliott's car.